Hi, welcome to class. I'm Barb Owen, and I'm so glad you're here for another class on how to get creative. Today, in this class, we are going to play and experiment with things you can do with mandalas that you might not otherwise expect to do with them. Now, the word mandala can be pronounced many ways. Mandala, mandala, uh, mandala. You can say it any way you like. We're going to play around with the circular art form based on my book that I wrote about a year ago that is called Mandala Melange. And this has all different kinds of patterns. It's an ebook, and in the class you will have several of the patterns included in the book that will be part of the class. So you'll have those as downloadable patterns to use in the class. Um, there's There are quite a few different designs in here that are meant for you to color and embellish to your heart's content. So the book is going to be a foundation for what we're doing. And let me show you what we're gonna do with the designs. We're gonna re-examine re something that was popular a long time ago and that's kind of making its entrance again, and that is um, a type of plastic that shrinks. And different companies make it, and we're gonna play with it and experiment and see what we can do. And from that, we are going to create Different things, you know, you'll have some ideas and some examples of things you can do with these pieces when you're finished with them. So from that great big pattern, we can do different kinds of things like this. So maybe charms for bookmarks. You can embellish your journals or art books or those kinds of things. You can do jewelry. You can do all different kinds of things with what we're going to do in this class. So I guess what we need to do is we just need to get started. 